Hello guys, I'm back with another video and today I'm going to be playing with the two teams that are in the Super Bowl. Um, I'm going to start off with the the Chiefs actually. Um, their team is looking incredible this year. You know they got Tyreek Hill, they got Ty Terrell Suggs, they got Tyron Matthew. You know, they're going to win the Super Bowl. I think so. Um, but yeah, look, I'll see you guys in the next shot when we make it there. From the site that many call All right, here we go, guys. Um, we are inside we're playing Arrowhead a Titans. Stadium here in Kansas Titans, City. the Tennessee the Titans. A few moments ago, here it is. It's unlike any other in sport as both teams. We gotta watch out for our boy These Henry. Are fired up as their guys are ready um, to do battle with the Tennessee Titans. Here's the kicker, Harrison. What's it for? Ready to get this one started. The receivers ain't that good either. From Arrowhead. That's fielded in the end zone. Ooh, I thought I was only able to strip him. the 20 and down at the 22-yard line. On the ground, this is Derek Henry. And he's going Are you good? This one across the 30-yard line. That's a first Derek Henry for Tennessee on a gain of 10. But well, that man, Derek Henry, Henry was right one of the there. stories of the postseason. Leading rusher in the NFL during the regular season, but even then, kind of under the radar. But he really showed America how valuable he was during that Titans postseason run. A three game stretch starting with okay. week 17. Charles 211. You got me right there, too. 182 versus the Pats. And I'm going to stop the bush here. I'm telling you. And what I think is surprising for people is, as you said, he was under the radar. But if you go back two seasons when they had a little bit of playoff success, remember when they won in Damn. Kansas City? All right, he's getting me a little bit. play where Marcus Mariota got the ball batted back to him. What they may have forgotten was Derrick Henry shredding the Kansas City defense with well over 100 yards in that game. So at playoff time, when he plays... Should have known he was going to run on a play I put and freaking cover three. Success. That's the kind of back that they have in Derrick Henry. Just a yard on the pick cool, up there, and it'll bring get up a second and nine. The run only got a yard. Here's second and nine. Derrick Henry. No, Derrick. Lose yardage on the play back at the 45-yard line. Come on now, Derrick. Loss of a yard, and it'll set up third down. Nice play right there to stop it behind the line, but I want to see how this defense continues to play him here in the first half. Yeah, we know. You know better than I. He has the ability to take over a game. So what do you do? Yeah, I think you have to make sure that you bottle him in. What the hell, him. Matthew? Because if you crowd everyone to the line of scrimmage, if he breaks through. Come on, Tyron. 23 yards, the final tally. Tannehill on first down. It's caught, Smith. Jesus Christ. Another good gain. That's now 35 yards combined on those last two plays. All right, he's beating our ass a little bit. I don't think it's a surprise they're throwing the football early. We expected that. They told us they were going to come out firing, but four for four on the opening drive. They like that. <laughs> they don't just nope. like it. They love it because now everyone gets locked in. The confidence jumps up. Everyone's easy about what they're doing out there. And by the way, they're looking at the sidelines thinking to themselves and expressing, let's keep the on it. We're doing pretty well. They'll give Henry another shot. No, Henry. He's met in his tracks behind the line of scrimmage. That'll be a loss of a yard, and it leads to a third down. Driven it down the field nicely here on the opening drive. No, Henry. Put up or shut up. No doubt about it, because to make that type of a drive and ultimately kick a field goal would feel very disappointing. But I'm just wondering, is the head coach thinking, is this four down territory? Might he go for Thank it? you. And it's intercepted at the goal line. Damn, I should never took it out. I thought I was going to be able to break through that. They'll be back deep in their own territory at the two-yard line. Uh, no doubt, a very disappointing end to what was a pretty strong opening drop. They had three points in their back pocket. It was there for them. If you don't like what you see, just throw it away. Make sure you get those points on the board. Catch, don't boy. Don't too greedy. He forced it there. You saw the end result. Give him 13 yards there and a Kansas City first down. Now here's Mahomes. Perfect. The tight end, Kelsey. We'll take that. 
past the 30 before he's hit and dropped. We're scoreless after one. Back-to-back -back good plays have him on the move on first down. From the gun, it's Mahomes. Got his man, it's Williams. Oh, okay. All right, we're on a roll, we're on a roll. That one good for 12 yards in a Kansas City first. They'll run with a backup. This is Williams. And a minimal gain here as he's up to about the 47-yard line. Two yards on the carry there. It'll be second down. Oh, he did exactly what I wanted him to do. That ain't worked out. Get the fuck off of me. Let's go. First down. We'll take that. All right, let's see. It's funny to watch the time that we've been together when we talk with running backs about the difference. Their eyes light up when they talk about open field and having one on one matchups, don't they? Yeah, they do. And that's the reason why. What we just saw shedding those tackles. Get off of me. Used to do. It is. Ankles. Let's go. Touchdown, baby. Ankles. We'll take that. All right, guys. So it's seven nothing. Now after the touchdown, here's Butker on to kick it away. Stop them in the red zone. Now they get the ball back. That'll be taken in the end zone. Did a little screen with Tyreek. And we strip him. Let's go. To the 25 yard line. We'll take that. Let's go. Let's see if we can get something in real quick. On first down, Mahomes. Ankles! Ankles! Touchdown, baby. Let's go. We got Tyreek Hill. Two catches, two touchdowns here so far. And the Chiefs are able to extend their lead. All right, it's 14 nothing. That's two touchdowns right there. Let's see if we can get another roll play. Kind of fucked up that kick. Works. First two drives, as you noted, end up in touchdown passes. I think they're going to keep going to them until a defense makes any kind of an adjustment. Oh, I was going to try to get him one more time. Now we got to watch out for Henry. The Titans are oh, set to begin the drive. Okay. Already down two touchdowns here in the first half. This becomes a pretty important drive, doesn't it? It certainly does. And a lot of teams script plays. We know that okay. right? they, they have a script he got us right there. the ball game. And typically those scripts go between 12 and 24, 25 plays. Down two touchdowns early. Probably not very deep into their script. I think that they'll stay with it. I don't think they'll abandon it just yet and try and generate some offense on this drive. Anything at least three points get that zero off. The Let's board. go. We got the sack, too. Let's go. I'm on fire right now. They're already up a couple scores, Brandon. And guess what? I think they're just gonna pin their ears back now and get up field get after the quarterback. Been such an impressive first half to get that lead. Come on, guys. Running back, it's complete. And he is down inside the 40, not quite to the 35. He caught a timeout. What's going to use the first of their timeouts? They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this second quarter. On first and ten, Tannehill. Thank you. Let's go. We'll take that. We'll take that. Three times in the first half, we just look at the offense and say, guys, what are you doing? Hey, fuck it. But instead, we really should be looking at the defense. They've created the takeaways. Two interceptions, one cause fumble. They pulled awfully well, swarming to the ball here in the first half. Ah, overthrew him. That was my bad. That was my bad. Picked by Kevin Byard. And his guys I are going to get the football at the 28 yard line. Coming up at halftime in a little less than two minutes, we'll send you to Orlando where Jonathan Coachman is standing by. He'll have highlights and analysis of this first half. Now this one complete to Corey Davis. Okay. And they work this well I'm trying to strip him too. Across the 45. Great way to start the drive. 20 big ones at a first down. Bravo! 
On first down, it's Tannehill. Forced out to his left. Oh, he'll try and throw it deep to the other side of the field. Oh, he almost caught that. Okay, that was crazy. That was crazy. Hold on through the contact. Brings up second down. He almost caught that one. Alright. He came in, made the contact. Just as he's trying to haul it in. To throw once more on second and ten. Tannehill complete. This is Lewis. Oh, he went straight out of bounds. Just shy of the 40. And at his size, Three inches. he's a smaller back. You can get him the football. He can kind of get lost, make someone miss. It's good for him. Yeah, it's great for him. I like what you said there. Sometimes he gets lost in the traffic a little bit. But get him out in the open field into some space. That plays to his strengths the best and keeps him out of it where all the I gave him are. You know, make him make I blitzed all my linebackers. So I thought he was running. To the air again, Tannehill. But that's what you're looking for when you're wanting to throw the ball downfield. You want one of those guys Ooh. who can play out on the perimeter, can play out wide, who can not only get open, but when they're covered, can uncover themselves downfield and create catches. That last catch short of the marker by just a yard leaves him with a very manageable. Oh, you should have picked that. Come on. Throw for the end zone, but it's incomplete. The coverage good that time by Kendall Fuller. This defense has been very disruptive early on as they force another one to go awry. Seems to be the front and the back end. Pass rush, they've been able to get home. We're trying to get a touchdown in before the end of this quarter. I love how you put it I'm pretty sure they're going to try to run it. Back, working in sync, only way to play good defense. With Harry, if they don't, they're stupid. Third and one. They tried All you need is one yard, and, and they don't do that. Now it's third and one. <laughs> Tannehill throwing again. Thank you again. Third time here in this half, it's intercepted. All right, we'll take that. Let's go. And he'll be brought down at his own 10 yard line. Well, partner, let's talk Super Bowl. We have to. Thank Before you. the year, by the way, we made predictions for the Super Bowl. You got one of the teams right. You had Kansas City and New Orleans, but you had the Saints winning. I also had the Saints there, but losing. Come on, to you got to catch that. Well, now we get a chance to rectify things. So, who's going to win the big game, partner? Well, I think San Francisco wins 35 34. MVP, usually a quarterback. But in this case, we're going to have an upset. Middle linebacker Fred Warner is going to have 13 tackles and an interception return for a touchdown and be the upset MVP winner over Jimmy Garoppolo because in the Super Bowl, if the quarterback does anything, he wins the award. But this time, the defense, which got them there, is going to take charge and Fred Warner walks away. Super Bowl MVP. 49ers Super Bowl champions. Wow, ah, that was my bad. On with great specifics there. I'll be a little bit more up. general. I'll just say that the Chiefs are going to win by a touchdown. And yes, I'll go with the MVP being number 15, Patrick Mahomes. And if you're not really rooting in this game, how great a matchup oh, is this? fantastic. Going to be a ton of fun. Oh, and he'll just get rid of this one deep. Ooh, he almost picked that. I don't know how he didn't pick it. Uh, Dory Jackson right there, step for step in coverage. An incomplete pass on that last play, and that means they'll need to come up with something. I'm just trying to get a touchdown real quick, that's all. Now it's Mahomes again. And off his back what the fuck was that, Mahomes? That was touchdown. One second left to go. On fourth down, on is Dustin Colquitt to kick this away. And they're going to fake it from deep in their own territory. And this is incomplete. <laughs> oh. A huge gamble, and it does that not was, pay I, I was joking around a little bit so right there. I don't know why the hell I thought this that was going to work, but I get the ball it's back anyway, so it doesn't even matter. Sports. Ready for the start of the third quarter. The Chiefs Can't get cocky. And set to receive the football. Let's see if I can take this back real quick. That's fielded in the end zone. Okay. Past the 20 to the 22 yard line. The Chiefs offense about set to begin this drive. They built a good first half lead. Now they have a chance to add on to it. And what I'm thinking is that the offensive staff spent the entire half time just working. Mm, I tried to freaking run. Here's what we think they're going to do to attack us in the second half. Nice first half Damn. we've had, guys, but be prepared for some change-ups. We're going to see them when we kick it off in the second half. See how they handle any adjustments that might be made defensively. 
Now Mahomes. There wasn't shit. I should have ran. Oh, just fuck. I, did, I just away. noticed that. The lines move then again, I don't even want to fumble, so. Second down. Well, Charles, you and I have made our predictions. Either way, I probably had to do that anyway. Coming soon, the official Madden NFL 20 Super Bowl prediction. Something Madden folks do every year is predict how they think the big game is going to play out. And that prediction, with the help, by the way, from Peyton. Ah, he didn't get his feet in. It's going to be revealed on Thursday, January 30th, 9 Eastern. Go to EA.com slash the prediction to check it out. And keep playing Madden to feed the machine and tell us who you think will win as well. Well, again, it's EA.com slash the prediction. They're going deep for Hill. Thank you. That's close. First down, we'll take it. And he finally is out of bounds, but he's down inside the 20 yard line. So the big play means just like that, they'll operate from the red zone now on first down. And he All right. down close to the. Oh, man. I think I'm going to make this guy quit. Is he going to quit? Yep. Let's go. We made him quit. All right, guys. So I'll see you guys for the next game. It's going to be the 49ers. Um, but, yeah, see you there. All right, guys. Here we go. We're facing the Vikings. The 49ers and the Vikings. It can certainly get loud inside this building. Just a few moments ago when the Vikings were in They get the ball first. It was downright shaking in here. They're set for football as the Vikings get ready to do battle with the San Francisco 49ers. This is fielded a couple yards deep. Ooh, I tried to strip him. Getting an extra couple yards here. The first game. As he'll bring this one out to the 27. Oh man, the 49ers defense is crazy. They got Richard Sherman. You know they got Nick Boza. How this guy's doing? Cousins on first down. And the throw left sideline nope. is caught, but they'll roll it in completely. Come on, Richard. You cannot leave him open like that. Second down. I don't know about you, but I wanted to reach out of the booth and snatch that pass myself. That thing floated forever up there. I think that threw off the timing of the receiver. That's why he couldn't get his feet down even though he caught the ball. You know, Charles, I, I would have liked to have seen that. Yeah, me I too. For, for you. I, I wanted to see you reach out and catch up. Yeah, you've heard about my hands, huh? <laughs> It'll be a gain of seven, and they get it back to a third and three. Throwing his cousins. Let's go. Good defense, guys. Bosa drops him for a loss of 12, and it also brings up fourth down. Fourth okay, look down. at this. The punt team nowhere to be found. They're on the sidelines. Fourth Offense down. It's going to go for this on the opening drive. Here's Cousins. Let's go. Good defense. Great, and he goes down Nick Bosa. Nick Bosa. And now possession All right. over inside the fifth. Starting off real line. good early. Our game not even two minutes old, but a quick red zone opportunity. They have a first and ten at the 13-yard line. This is Coleman. Ankles. And he's going to work this one down to about the five. Seven yards on the pick up there, and it'll leave it with a second and three. Well, one of the big questions in the lead up to Super Bowl 54, the health of Tevin Coleman. We saw him go down fairly early in that NFC Championship game against Green Bay, and you thought, oh, boy, that doesn't look good. Touchdown, George Kittle. Touchdown, 49ers. Let's go. A five-yard touchdown catch as his guys are able to strike first here in this opening quarter. And we'll take it. With the extra point, and it's now a 7-0 game. Let's see if we can get a strip real quick. As they run up and send this one away. Strip down the way. This fielded a few yards into the end zone. Oh, we couldn't get a strip. And nope. the decision to bring it out, a good one, as he's up a yard or two shy of the 30. The Minnesota offense about ready to get this next drive underway. And last time out, went for it on fourth down. They turned it over, gave him great field position, turned him six points up. They've got a real Thank you. Looking for Johnson, and it's intercepted. Ankles. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Wow, he quit, too. Uh, should I play one more game? No, I'm not going to play one game. But, alright guys. 
Um, thank you for watching. Like this video. Subscribe to my channel. Um, and yeah, I'll see you next time.